right, well, um, can, can, um, I, can I tell you, I wonder you why. like, what's really going on? What? Could I tell you, like, what's really going on here? Tell me, sir. Don't mind me, Jake. Just jot him down my grocery list for later. <laughs> Calling support. My name is David. How can I help today? Uh, yes, sir. I had got a pop-up on my computer, and uh, mm -hmm. I think my computer is infected. Alright, sir, and can you tell me, like, uh, since how long you're getting this problem on the computer, sir? Um, I just got home from work, and it just mm -hmm. started. And It just, yeah. Mm hmm It just started, right? Did you, did you, like, you was doing something on the computer, like you tried to open any link on the computer? Uh, yes, sir. You was doing something on the computer, and it's the first time you like you realize like computer is getting infection, or you're getting problem for a long time, sir. Oh, could you repeat that? Like it's the first time you you're looking for these infections on the computer, or you're you're getting this problem long time. No, this right here is the first time. First time you got this problem, right? Mm-hmm. No problem, sir. I will check it for you. What kind of infections your computer infected? So I can first show you the infections and we'll try to check it for you how we're gonna fix this problem for you, okay? Okay. And right now which particular Windows you are using? It's seven, eight or is Windows ten? Uh this right here is Windows XP. You're using Windows XP, right? Mm-hmm. Are you in front of your computer right now? Yes sir. Alright, do one thing on your Windows XP computer, open your browser. You are using internet? Oh uh, yes I am. You're using internet. So open the, your internet explorer like Microsoft Edge. Okay. It's open. Uh give me one moment here. Sure. Okay. Now once you open your browser on the very top you can see there is one long address bar. Mm -hmm. You have to type it there, www dot. Mm -hmm. H like Harry. Jake, where did the time like go? Mm -hmm. Can't L you like just Nima. feel us getting closer with every new day? Uh -huh. Then it's mm -hmm. B like Peter. Uh -huh. M like Mother. Uh -huh. E like e like Edward. Uh -huh. Dot N like Nancy. Uh -huh. E like Edward. Uh -huh. T like Tiger. Uh -huh. So just confirm me, sir, like what exactly you type it there. I have www.helpme.net. That's right. Now you have to just press the enter key. Once you hit an enter, sir, on the computer, it come up there, establish a support connection, I think. It's asking for your name and the support key, right? Uh, it says the page cannot be displayed. This page cannot be displayed? Uh, yes, what it says. Just, just check it, sir, like as if the internet is connected with the computer or not. Just yeah. check your internet. Oh, it, uh, I have internet access. Uh, I think I do. Just check it, sir. Is it, it connected with the Wi Fi or you have router? Uh, I'm not real sure. Uh, it's, it's some type of cord that plugs into it. Yeah, just check it, sir. Maybe the internet is not working on the computer. So just check it, the internet connection and let me know.
Uh, everything appears to be okay here. You can you can do one thing, sure, on your computer. Uh, press the Windows key and R like a robot on the keyboard. You can see on the keyboard, uh, left hand side corner, bottom there is a Microsoft key. It seems like a window, right? Mhm. Mm press it and hold that key down, and then at the same time press R like Roger. Okay. Right. Then I hope so. It appear one run box. Uh huh. On, on that run box, sir, you have to first make that box empty. And once it got empty, then you have to uh, type it there, www. Uh -huh. Google.com, G-O-O-G-L-E, Google.com. Okay. Okay, now click on OK. Once you click on OK, then tell me, like, Google, it's coming on the computer or not? No, it's not. What's coming up? It says the page cannot be displayed. So the internet, it's not working on the computer. Just check it through your internet connection. Check it your wire code, which is connecting your internet to this computer. Check it if, if it's connect or not. Just check it once. Okay, give me one moment. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, it's connected. Sir, it seems like that it's not because the website are not able to open on the computer. Uh, you you can you can do one thing. Are you able to open your email on this computer? Just try to log in on your email. Alright, give me one second. Yes, sir, I can, I can log into my email. Sorry? Yes, I can. You can log into your email, right? Uh-huh. You can then uh, do one thing. Press the Windows key and R like a robot one more time. Uh-huh. Then uh, got one box again. Mm-hmm. Make that box empty. Mm-hmm. Then type it there, H like Harry. Mm-hmm. Then one more time, H like Harry. Mm -hmm. Then give us space. Mm -hmm. Then one more time, H like Harry. Mm -hmm. Then you have to press an OK there. Once you press an OK, you what you can see on the computer exactly? Tell me, sure. It says HTM, uh, HTML help. The page cannot be right. displayed. Yes, do one thing, sir. Make that page bigger. Okay. Uh -huh. Then, then look at on the very top left hand side corner. There is one yellow color question mark, right? On the very top left hand side corner, it's like a small yellow color question mark. Uh, on the very top, on the very top left hand side corner. Not seeing that. I will tell you. Once you maximize it, sir. It will coming up on the very top left hand side corner, HTML help and just if you look at there is one yellow color question mark. My favorite subject. Bananas. What I you can see on the computer screen, tell me that. I see um keep your knees. This is a vast pop up. I see back. Stop, refresh, print, and options. Yes, where you can see back, stop, refresh, just look it up there. There's one question mark. No question mark. They, there's one small yellow color question mark. Survey, it's HTML help written. You can see on the very top left hand side. HTML help is written. Okay, I see it now. Okay. Press the question mark. Okay. Then you have to click on the option says jump to URL. Click there. Okay. Now you got the box there. Mm -hmm. You have to type it where it says jump to this URL. Type it over there www. Uh -huh. Help H E L P help mm -hmm. me mm -hmm. dot net n e t net. Mm -hmm. Then you have to press on OK there. 
Mm-hmm. Once you press an OK, I hope so now it's coming up established support connection. Uh, hold on one second. Mm. Uh, like it's loading something? It's still not doing anything. It's loading? No, it's not doing anything. Did you press on OK? Uh huh. Once you press on OK, what you can see there? It, it, it didn't do anything. It just says the page cannot be displayed. Sir, the internet is not working on the computer, sir. Check if your internet connection first of all. Okay. Did you check it? Uh, can I use Firefox? Yeah, you can try to open the Firefox here. Open that. Uh-huh. Did you open Firefox? Uh, yes I did. You can see the search box on the very top. Uh -huh. Type it there, www. Uh -huh. Help me. Jake, -E I noticed that you have been looking sharp as a taxi did. Okay. Now hit on enter. Then it's coming up there, establish support connection. Mm -hmm. Put your name there, sir. It's asking for your name. Can you see it, sir? Okay, yes, and it's uh, asking for support key. Yeah, put your name there, then I will provide you your support key, okay? Okay. Just be with me, sir, so I can provide you your support key, okay? So just take one minute, okay? Mm hmm. Now I'm just ch the your support key numbers are six two zero. Okay. Three three five six. Uh huh. Five three one. Now okay. you have to click on continue. Once you click on continue, what you can see there? Uh, it asks me, opening go assist opener dot exe. Yeah. Open that, sir. Alright. Once you open that, what you can see there? Um, it downloaded a file. Sure. Once this download complete, you can open that file, okay? Alright. Sure. And what's your name is? Uh, can I have your name? Uh, yes, my name is Jake. It's gay, right? No, no, I'm not gay. I'm sorry. Um, Jake. J-A-K-E. Uh, J-A-K-E. Jake, right? Uh-huh. That's great. So, Mr. Jake, you're talking with David, okay? Okay. Which, uh, what's your last name? It's David Miller. Okay. okay. Alright. Uh, should I run this file? Yeah, run that, sir. Once you run that, what you can see next to it? Uh, show log file or close. Sh uh, show that, sir. Click on show. Okay. Once you show that, you can see any file by the name of go to assist or. Mm -hmm. You can open it, sir. Okay, it's open. Once you open that, what you can see there? Um, it's a whole bunch of writing. Like it's connecting? Um, uh, no, it's not connecting, not just yet. Um, it opened up a notepad. It opened a notepad? Uh huh. Close this notepad, sir. Uh huh. Once you close this notepad, now what you can see on the computer screen? 
Uh, I don't see anything now. Uh, it went away. Just try to go and download. What you're doing on the computer? Can you tell me? Uh, I'm trying to find the file. Yeah. Check on the downloads. There will be the file by exe. Funny joke. Anyone? Anyone? What did the fever say to the tree? I'm not. It's been nice knowing you. I'm not seeing it. Uh, it's not in my. It's not in my downloads. It's not in your downloads, right? No. You can try one more time, sir. Go back. Uh huh. And open your uh, Mozilla <coughs> Firefox once again. Mm -hmm. Then type it there. Once mm -hmm. you open it, type it over there. www. Mm -hmm. Team. T E A M. Team. Mm -hmm. Then it's viewer. V I E W E R. Mm -hmm. V I E W E R dot com. It's www.teamviewer.com, all right, sir? Now, hit and enter. Once you hit and enter on the computer, you can see it's coming up official side of Team Viewer. It's, you can see it, there's one box where you can download that. Okay, uh, give me one second. My internet's a little slow. It's no problem. Which internet you're using? It's AT&T, Verizon. Uh... I think it's uh, Comcast. Comcast, okay. Once it's complete there, you can tell me, okay? Okay. Now it's coming up something? Uh-huh. It's coming or not, sir? Yes, uh, yes it is. What it says? Uh, it says Team Viewer. Are you able to download that? Uh-huh. Click, click on Download. Once you click on Download, what you can see there? Um, it popped up in the middle of my screen, Team Viewer 12 setup. Yeah, install it, sir, on that. Should I choose, uh, basic or... Yeah, uh, you have to click on personal, yeah, basic installation, click there. For the personal use. Okay. Then you, then you have to accept it. Once you accept it, what you can see there? Uh, it's still in, it's still installed right now. Hey, Jake, you are looking it's quite nice installing. today. Oh, excuse me. It's installing, sir. Uh huh. Once it's installed complete, you can tell me, okay? Okay. Sure. All right. It's uh it says partner ID. Uh. Mm, yeah. Yes, you have to uh, provide me your ID. Tell me your ID, sir. It's uh, 129 mm -hmm. 668 mm -hmm. 946 mm -hmm. um, And the password? It is 9340 right. Be with me, okay? Hold on. Alright. Hold on. All right, sir. I'm just connecting with the computer. Just allow me one minute, okay? Uh huh. All right, sir. Right now your computer is get connected. Now allow me one minute so I can check it for you. What sort of infections your computer is getting, okay? Mm -hmm. Be with me. Hold on. All right. Sir, be with me. I'm just checking few things on the computer, okay? Okay. Hold on. Be with me. And you was telling me, sir, you are getting some infections coming up on the computer, am I right, sir? Yes, sir. And you got this infection today itself, right? Yes, sir. Uh, I just come home from work and this had a pop-up on my screen and had y'all's number on the screen. Um, I don't have a pop-up anymore because it froze my whole computer up. And it froze your whole computer. So how old your computer is, basically? Uh, it's probably about maybe 13 years old. Okay, and when was the last time you got service your computer? 
Uh, I probably got it serviced maybe a year and a half ago. Okay, let me just check it for you, see whether your computer running with any infections or not, okay? Mm -hmm. Eating the right things is very healthy. That's not to say that you should eat only bananas. Yum! Packed with vitamins and minerals. Okay, now I was just checking the infections coming up on the computer, so let me show you what are the infections you're getting on the computer, okay? Be with me, okay? Mm -hmm. Hold on. You there? Uh, yes, I am. Sir, have a look on the computer. You can see it's coming up number of events, applications. It's 150 infections you're getting on the computer. So there's a very huge number of infections which your computer is getting. You can, you can see there are lots of warnings and errors, warnings coming up on the computer, sir. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's most just, definitely just because, Yeah, just because of this infection, sir, your computer got froze up. Uh, and could you tell me, sir, do you allow anyone to use this computer apart from you? Uh, well, my kids. Your kids, like, they fond of playing any games on the computer sometime? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, I mean, work. You're not sure because, because these kind of infections, sir, they can come in the computer if you play any games on the computer, watch any videos on the computer. Because it seems like that you got some kind of suspicious problem coming up on the computer. That's why the reason you got this kind of, uh, you know, infections coming up on the computer. Mm -hmm. Okay. And this infection, sir, is not something that's come to the itself. Infections <laughs> you're getting on the computer for last a couple of days back. Mm -hmm. it's, not, it's not happened today. I will show you. I'll just allow me one minute. Let me just show you. Be with me. You can see this coming up there in time. Some of them you got a 19, and if I scroll it down for you to check it. I got another one for you. Why do they call HTML hyper text? See this. Too much Java. Dead in time. Can you see it, sir? Wow. I even Dead amused time. myself with that one. Can you see it, sir? Uh, okay. Dead, okay. dead in time. Yeah. So that simply means you're getting some kind of serious problem coming up on the computer. So what's the, what's the thing? I will check it on the computer. Apart from this infections, you're getting any other problem or not, okay? Mm -hmm. And you have any other computer apart from this? Uh, my wife, she has a computer, yes. Your wife. Which Windows she is using? Uh, she's also using, uh, I think it's XP. Windows XP, right? Be with me, okay? I will check it. Right now, sir, I'm running this performance scan on the computer. With the help of this, I will able to tell you, apart from infections, you got other problems on the computer or not, okay? Mm -hmm. So, allow me one minute. It will get complete. I will uh, tell you then, okay? Mm -hmm. Sure, hold on.
You there? <laughs> yes, I am. There, are you? Yeah, look it on the computer screen, sir, what exactly it's coming up. Have a look there. First of all, the very first one is coming up infected with viruses. Can you see it? Oh, Second no. one is the yeah, computer security not working. And third one is says computer is at risk, sir. Right? So the bottom line, sir, what thing which I found on the computer right now, there is no kind of particular security running on the computer. And just because it's, sir, you got infections coming up on the computer and a computer got froze up. Hmm. So what do we need to do? I mean, how do we fix it? Sure. Yeah, to fix this problem, sir, what exactly required? Because it's a, uh, a computer which you're using for a couple of years back. So I would suggest you maybe some of the security got expired on the computer. So we have to reinstall the securities on the computer. Plus, we have to secure your computer also. Because if you do any kind of uh, personal work on the computer, like online banking or shopping, so information is also on risk. So we cannot take any chance here. We have to install securities, which is compatible for Windows XP, so we can fix the issue for you, okay? Mm -hmm. Because these kind of uh, infections, if you have any other computer, it can be get spread to other computers also, which are connected with the same network, same Wi-Fi, okay? So without wasting your time, sir, I will tell you which particular security is compatible for your Windows XP, okay? Okay. Be with me, okay? Hold on. Okay. If you don't mind, Jake, I'm going to just relax and listen to some nice tunes for a while. I'll be right here if you need me. You there? Yes, sir. All right, sir, now I will just tell you which particular security is required to get installed on the computer. And one thing, sir, I would like to tell you, till a time technician will gonna work on the computer, do not do any kind of personal work on this computer, and you can tell your wife also, do not work any kind of personal work on her computer too, okay? Oh, okay. Right. Now, first of all, sir, I'm providing a basic information, and I will request you, uh, grab a pen and paper. Okay. First of all, sir, I'm writing you my name. My name is David. I hope you remember. Okay, I will. My extension ID 1408. And our toll free number, which I will provide you, be with me. It's 844. 877-3044, sir. That's the only number where you can give me a call in future you're getting any sort of problems coming up on the computer, okay? Mm -hmm. Do you remember in future you or your wife is facing, both of you facing any problems coming up on the computer? Just dial this number, okay? Okay. Okay. Now, first of all, sir, the exact uh, time duration, this all problem, it will gonna take at least 60 to 80 minutes to fix all the issues because it's kind of multiple problems you're getting on the computer so it's required this much time okay uh -huh. okay they will gonna totally clean up your computer from all the infections so in you will never get any infections found on the computer again all right and right now sir you're using windows xp okay mm -hmm. you're using windows xp on the computer so the compatible security for your windows xp i will tell you that's called anti-malware software, which one is compatible security for your Windows XP. Do remember, till that time, this will gonna work on the computer. You will never get this kind of problems again on the computer, okay? Okay. All right, this is the anti-malware software, sir. We're gonna take care of the computer. Do remember, Till that time, the security is going to work on the computer. You will never get any infections coming up on the computer, okay? And uh, that means if your chill kids, like they're playing any games on the computer, would be totally secure. If you're doing any kind of browsing on the computer, it would be totally secure for you, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. Now, apart from this, browsing, whatever you do on the computer, you can tell me, sir. Uh, I do banking. In, um, with me, sure. in, banking, yeah. Uh, Facebook. Uh, I do shopping online. Uh, Just a second, sir. You do, you do Facebook on the computer, and you do shopping also, right? Uh huh. 
be with me. So whatever the activity you do on the computer, shopping, Facebook, any other thing you do apart from this, you can tell me because I want to make it secure for you. Uh, that's oh. all. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <clears throat> Sorry. That's it. All right, sir. So whatever you do on the computer from today onwards will be totally gonna safe and secure for you. So in future, you will never come to get any infections coming up on the computer or you got some kind of, uh, you know, blocking on the computer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Right. Now, apart from this, sir, once your work will get complete totally, uh, technical team, they will gonna also tune up your computer every month just for the better performance of the computer. You can give us any every, you know, every month like you know just for the regular tune up of the computer so you know it, that way uh, like computer you can use for a couple of more years okay okay yeah i got a question for you uh, i noticed that you gave Go me ahead, your, sure. i noticed that you gave me your name and your extension mm -hmm. and id and y'all's number yes. do y'all have yes. like a uh, like a dress or anything uh like exact uh-huh go ahead go ahead sir do y'all have like a um like a billing address, like if I ever needed to like bill y'all something, um, I mean. Exactly, exactly, sir, you will get all, all the company information on the email. You will get all the documents on the email. Once you compare, it will get fixed. You'll got to provide the company information, address, everything on the email. Don't have to worry about it, okay? Okay. All right. You can do one thing, sir. Type it there, your first and your last name. phone number all right this right here is a new uh, phone number sir uh, I'm asking for I, I'm asking for your number either your home number or your cell phone number I, I think I'm lagging but there's my number right there it, that's my number that's, that's your home or that's your cell that, that's my cell phone great Your email also, sir. Tap it there. You're, so you're using the Yahoo account, right? Oh, you say what now? You're using the email which you're using. You're using the Yahoo account, right? I'm using this uh, Yahoo account. The Yahoo account is my main account. That's great, sir. So you will get all the company information on this mail, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. And this security, it will come the uh, license for it. Minimum license, it will gonna coming up on the computer for the two years of license, and maximum, it will coming up on the computer for the five years. And it's come the last one option. That's a lifetime license on the computer. So that way, you don't have to renew your security or your subscription of license security again and again on the computer, okay? Mm -hmm. Lifetime security is the best option for it, sir. It can be transferable. So if in future your wife wants to get her, you know, security on her computer too, it can be transfer services to one more computer. Okay. All right. Uh, could you hold on one second? I have to take a really big dump. I mean, could could you could you give me like maybe three minutes? Sure, sure. Take your time. All right. I just gotta really take a big dump. Oh. Sure, sure. Okay, um, actually someone's in the bathroom, so, okay. <laughs> you have a dog, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, they're, like, uh... It's, it's which one? Like, which breed do you have? Um, he's Chihuahua. And then I have a, a German Shepherd and I have a, a Pitbull. See, <laughs> Pitbull also. Like, all the dogs you have so dangerous, right? Uh, well, the German Pitbull, Shepherd Pitbull is... always, Pitbull always looks so dangerous. Oh, she, she's really a big baby. So how are you taking care of these all? Because they are so dangerous, right? Um, 
Well, he uh, well the the pit like, bulls. You are you are you are you know afraid like habitual of that or like they they you know like, like they treat like a friend. Oh no, uh, they're 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 good dogs. The German Shepherd, you know, he would try mm -hmm. to bite your toes off. But the girl mm -hmm. dog, the pit bull, she she's just a big baby. Mm -hmm. So that's no problem. So nice to hear that you have your you know like you love dogs, right? Now the two years, uh, it's coming up. The cost for the two years, I will tap it for you. Uh huh. Okay. Five years, it's coming up. Complete peace of mind for the five years. Uh huh. And if you want to cover your wife's computer too, then I would suggest you you can go for the lifetime security. Lifetime security, it will coming up for complete peace of mind for upcoming eight to uh, ten years. So in that way, you don't have to renew your services, renew your security every year. You will get complete peace of mind for lifetime on the, both the computers, and it will gonna cover your all devices. Okay. Mm hmm. So which license you want to go for, sir? Of two years, five years, or a lifetime? Um, I'm not gonna keep this computer at much longer or whatever. Exactly, sir. You can easily, if you purchase new computer like uh, seven, eight, or ten, you can easily get fast for the same security to Windows, three Windows also, seven, eight, or Windows ten, because they are easily compatible for all the Windows. So don't have to worry about that, okay? And that's one reason I check it. With security is compatible for you all the Windows, okay? Mm -hmm. You don't have to worry. You have my number. Whenever you bought new computer also, or your wife, she changed her computer too, you can tell me, David, I purchased new computer. I want to get computer secure, and we're going to do it for you, okay? Okay. Right. It depends on which license you want to go. Two years, five years, or want to go for the lifetime license. So we can secure the information too, and as well as your computer too. I kind of agree with you. The five years does... Uh... Mm -hmm. you know, five years well, five years would be coming up your computer, your wife's computer too. And if in future you bought any other computer, you can tell me. We will do all the you know, best possibilities for our side, okay? Yeah. Yeah, my dogs, I think they need to go outside and take a dump too. Uh, hey, champ, you need to go outside and take a shit? You need to go outside? I think I need to feed my dogs too. They're, they're getting hungry. Which license you want to go, sir? You can tell me. Oh, uh, you just take your time and think about it. Two years will be coming up on your computer. Five years will be coming up on yours and your wife's computer too. I'm thinking about it right now. Uh, just give me just a just give me a, a minute. Sure. Uh, the five right. years, the, the five years sounds okay with me. All right. Uh, can you tell me one thing, sir? Like your wife, which Windows she is using on her computer? Um, it's uh, Windows XP. Windows XP, right? Mm -hmm. So I will make it this five years of security on the computer. Do remember, upcoming five years, getting any problem, you can free to give us all any time. Okay. Mm-hmm. Right now, be with me, sir. Type it there your mailing address also, so we can mention on the you know mailing address on your email. Tap it in mailing address, sir. Uh, Are you typing? Oh, uh, right here. Okay. Can can you see me typing? Yes, 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 I can see it, sir. Now you're typing, yeah. You type it, your CD and the state too, sir. <laughs> like you don't remember it? Uh, actually, like I said, my computer is lagging and, yeah, it's really messed up really bad, but, yeah. It's messed up really bad. No problem. But uh, yeah, we we moved recently and stuff, so yeah. I mean. Oh, no, yeah. no problem. So you can tap at your address completely. Don't add you had take your time.
All right, uh, how, how is that right there? Got it, sir. Six zero one eight five. That's your zip code, right? Mm hmm. Great, sir. And the company Check. information which you're gonna mention you're there, I will tell you. On a little there is email which you receive by the name of Universal Network. Solutions. Okay, sir. That's a, a company information which you will receive on the email. I will request you, <laughs> please make a down this information. U N I V E R S E L Universal Network Solution LLC. Okay. Mm -hmm. Please make down this information on the piece of paper, sir, which is very important. All right. And you will be get covered the five years of security on your computer and as well as your network security on the wife's computers too. So you both of the computer would be secure for you, okay? Okay, sir. Okay. All right. Now for the payment option, how you make the pay how will you will make the payment? I will tell you the best safe and secure mode of payment, okay? Okay. The first option would be the check option for you. And second one would be the bill pay, okay? Mm -hmm. I will tell you how it will gonna work. First technicians, they're gonna fix all the issues getting on the computer. Once your computer will get fixed, I will call you on this number, which is 484-453-8420, so we can show you all securities on the computer. And then billing department, they will gonna do rest of formalities for you, okay? Okay. First of all, you decide like which option you wanna go for, check option or the bill pay. Because check option would be like an electronic check for you, where information would be totally safe and secure for you in computer. So you want to make a determined with the help of the check? Um, I only have a visa. Sir, I will tell you seriously, sir, I will not allow you to use any of the card information on your computer because your computer is not secure. So I will not allow you to use any of the card information. You can, you can understand, right? Uh, yeah, I understand, but, you know. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. I will, I will tell you, sir, how a check will gonna work. First, technician will fix the problem. Then, uh, once I will show you all securities, billing department, sir, they will gonna open the uh, payment form in the computer where you can uh, put up your check information. And that check will gonna go like electronic check for you, okay? Okay. And that way, inform information will be totally safe and secure for you, okay? Um. All right, sir. Well, I mean, I don't, I don't have, uh, you know, checks. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, I'm. Not that rich, I mean. So how do I look? No, no, you don't. You don't have check. Pretty snazzy you. for you. you. It's all purple. You realize I do say so myself. I only have visa. You just have the visa card, right? Right. That's all I have. And you have visa card, and you have the sufficient amount on the visa card, right? Mm hmm. Sure, no problem, sir. Once the vehicle get comes to billing department, they will make the payment of the card. That's not a problem, okay? Mm hmm. So you can leave your computer as this, let's technician first fix the problem, and once your computer will get fixed, I will call you on this number. That's your home number or that's your cell phone number, sir? Just try to use my cell phone number. Cell phone. So I will call you on this cell phone number and do pick us pick the call. I will give you a call in the next one or hardly, okay? Okay. So thank you so much, uh, Mr. Jake, for giving your time, sir. Wait for my call. I will give you a call once your computer will totally get fixed, okay? Okay. So leave your computer and wait for my call, sir. Thank you so much for giving me time, sir. Bye bye. I will give you a call once the work will get complete, okay? Yeah. Okay. All right. You can now hang up and uh, you can leave your computer as this. We will gonna start fixing this problem for you, okay? All right. Uh, how long is this gonna take? I mean, um... It will, it will gonna take 60 to 80 minutes to fix all problems on the computer. So 60 to 80 minutes, you have to leave your computer as it is, okay? Uh, let me ask, um, mm -hmm. let, me, let me ask my wife, is this, uh, okay? Hold on one second. Sure. Well, my wife said that, uh, that's kind of too long because, you know, we need our computer, like, um, well, you know, right now and everything, so, yeah. So you can, did you ask your wife now, you leave your computer for 6 to 8 minutes, we will gonna start fixing and once it will get fixed, we will call you then, okay sir? Actually, I'm about to go to bed, I mean, you know.
uh, right now, right now, sir, it's seven forty-eight. So, you, when you want me to give you call back in next, uh, like uh, sixty minutes, one of my favorite websites is www.bongli.com. All right, well, um, can, can um, I can I tell you I wonder why. like what's really going on? What? Could I tell you like what's really going on here? Tell me, sir. Well, um, I already know what y'all are doing and everything, and this right here is not a real computer. <laughs> this right here is a virtual <laughs> machine, and I know that y'all are scammers. <laughs> and I'm recording all this right here, and it's going to be posted on YouTube because it's not right for y'all to scam people and, you know, fuck the shit out of people, you know, for their money. Any comments? God bless you. <laughs> I just tell you that one. Any comments? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> what do you have to say? Eh? No comment. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you have it, folks. So, uh, yeah. He's still connected. Or er, no, he's not connected. He just quit. <laughs> well, <laughs> I was hoping to hear one of those comments like "You fucking dirty ass American, I'll fuck your sister" or something <laughs> like that. I'm waiting on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> He said, what? Uh, oh, he said. Yeah, he was like, yeah, you, you, you heard, so, you heard, you for once heard some sincerity. He was like, what? Well, I guess, uh, it's not me getting fucked. I guess he got fucked. No lube. So, uh, which right here is the end of this video. You know, you know. So, uh, yeah. Tickle, tickle. <laughs> so, uh, hope y'all Tickle the bonsai, it. buddy. <laughs> I, 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 I was hoping that he was going to, you know, uh, do more or whatever, but, yeah. He cracked me up. He cracked me up. He had some good jokes. <laughs> yeah, uh, it says close all connection, but, yeah. It is what it is. All right, man. I'll be right back. I just got to walk the dog, all right? All right.